Okay, we are back, guys, and my javelin throwers, pretty sure that's what they called them, they're building up, so I think I'm about to hit 50, and when I do, because 50 is the maximum, I'm going to build them up, and I do kind of want to build up a little army of nobles, just because I like showing off the number one troops, giving them their props or whatever, so here we go, I'm going to... But that is one thing I, I forgot to say. On nobles, you heard me talking about how the population doesn't decrease. With nobles, it is the only troop that actually will decrease the population because they're not hired assassins. They're actually people from the village. So, yeah. And there we go. What about my, my elephant? Yeah, my elephant's still in there. So, I'm going to let my army build up a little bit because I just don't want to crush them right away. We want to have somewhat of an epic ending, I guess. You call that. So, <clears throat> I don't know. I might just try to play one more 1v1, I guess. I might do one more. I think there's a map where you can do three people. So, that might be pretty good. Slowly work up to be taking on four or something. But, yeah, these uh, guys aren't giving much of a challenge in. I like a challenge, so. I think after this we're going to be moving on to something probably a little bit more difficult. We'll see. So, basically what I'm doing is now I'm going to send in my armies. And they're going to be approaching on in. And this is going to be a pretty one side to victory. You see, um, yeah, they're not really doing much. Even their healers are about to die. So, this is just going to kind of be like the last episode of the Praetorians. They just went in and killed everything, which was pretty great. But yeah. We'll see. So I'm going to send in my javelin throwers, and we're about to take down this here wall. And once we take this wall down, it's going to go downhill from them. So we'll see how it goes. There we go. Got to get this down a couple seconds, and bang. So that is done. And I'm just going to send them away because all they're going to do is... So, here we go, this is um, a little over 100 troops, maybe about 120, and normally I would just send in the nobles by themselves, but let's just go all out and slaughter them. So here we go. And, wow, that is some close battle, let me tell you guys, oh, wow. Well then, I might have lost a total of two troops, maybe more, but I'll get what I'm saying. So yeah, dang. So this video is probably going to be pretty short, so maybe I can just talk about something. Let's take a look at the statistics, because, you know, I, really, I don't want to just put like a two minute video out, so let's see what we got. So yeah, as you see, he had 1%, which is pretty sad, and then I said I would show y'all that it was on hard, just uh. Well, I'm not BSing, but there you go. It is, as you can clearly see, on hard. And, yeah, it didn't really work out, I guess. So, I don't know what to say. I mean, like I said, um, I think I'm going to be doing one where there may be a total of three, three or four nations or either me and my brother, if I can once again get him to play, go up against two hards or something. But yeah, we'll work it out and see how it'll go, and so, this video's going to be a little bit short, but um, I'll try to get a little bit longer and bigger battle in, because none of the battles have really been that big yet, compared to some of the ones I've been in, so, in the next um, couple episodes, hopefully enter some of those big battles, but until then, I'll see y'all later, guys, and thanks for watching.